there's just um, how do you guys be able to fight back in the series and like ultimately taking it? Uh, what have you seen these last two days? I, I thought the last two days uh, we played clean baseball. Um, I thought the pitchers, starting pitchers, set the tone, and uh, I, I thought the team offense was back. We um, played, took better at bats one through nine. And um, got hits when we needed to. And you know, today, just uh, having the at bats that we had against Wayne Wright, stressing him, getting him out after three innings, um, getting to the pen. And you know, he did a good job of limiting damage, but to get to the pen was, was big. And can't say enough about Michael uh, today. He was under the weather, and um, but was determined he was going to make this start. And so. After that fifth inning, I just felt that he gave us everything he had, and I uh, you know, really tipped my cap to him. You guys, uh, with the win today, it's 106 wins this season. You guys achieved that last year, tying the franchise record, uh, but fell short of the NL West. So, what does it mean to you to not only have achieved this again this year, uh, have the opportunity to break it this year? Uh, what is that just? Um, I think uh, it just speaks to the level of uh, consistency, um, excellence. And um, this is, we put ourselves in a really good spot. And um, part of getting to, you know, where we want to get to is you've got to dominate and play well throughout the regular season. And uh, we've been as consistent as anyone. And so, yeah, the goal is to keep winning baseball games. You guys are actually the first team to win 106 or more in three consecutive full seasons in Major League Baseball history. I know you're kind of in the thick of things, but like, are you able to kind of take a step back and appreciate the time of winning? I probably could do a better job. I, it, it's it's amazing. Um, I didn't realize that. That's you know you're looking at a lot of years of baseball, almost 200 years of baseball. Um, so to do that again speaks to the consistency, the level of excellent excellence. You know the standard that we set here with the Dodgers, and um, it takes a lot of people to accomplish what we've done. And your point is the last four years, parts of the last four years. So um, there's a lot of people that deserve the credit. Going back to Michael, was he sick enough that you had considered swapping him out at any point? You know, he just wouldn't let us give us that option. Uh, I, I know a couple days ago he just was weak and didn't feel good, and we were kind of teetering. And yesterday he said, you know, I'm going to figure it, figure it out and find a way to post and send him home early, you know, before the game started. And um, today he just kind of showed up, and there was no side doors. He was going to pitch today. And uh, like I said, proud of him, he gave us everything he had. Do you know if it's the same thing Freddie was dealing with? Not sure. Not sure. Was he using the that you did, sort of some of the dry run type stuff you talked about before? No, no. Today with, with uh, Andre, it was here, having him here uh, to fulfill a role to take down you know, a few innings if possible and um, give us a chance to reset our bullpen with the off day tomorrow. Um, and for me, I just felt that you know, once we got to that seventh inning and, and we handed him the baseball, I thought he was throwing the baseball well. So for me, I just wanted to continue to run the play out and give an opportunity for the save. And um, to his credit, he finished the game. It was great to see. Some of the guys in there didn't know that this was clinched after the National League playoffs. What does that say about their kind of ability to kind of put their head down and just focus on, on the day? That, that's, a, that's a compliment. Um, I think that it's not taking away from we don't appreciate it. Um, but I think that in a long season, um, the hard thing to do is to focus uh, in, the, in the present. And the easy, what is the most natural way to do it is hear all the noise and, and look out. Um, but our guys do a great job of trying to win today's game. And you know, we all have plenty of time to look back on our accomplishments. What have you seen in Cody in the last few days? He seems like he's a lot quieter. He, he's a lot more controlled with his body. Um, and when you're talking about controlling the lower half of the body, then the head stays more still. Um, he's controlling the strike zone really well, and he's taking much better swings and having great at-bats. Thanks, guys.